Hello from Stockholm! Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna do an unboxing and a review of my latest addition to my bag collection, which is, as you already know because you saw the title of the video, the Louis Vuitton Pochette Métisse. So I've wanted this bag for a really long time. I've been calling Louis Vuitton and they've told me it's so loud in all of Europe. And then a few weeks ago, we went to Dubai. Me and my boyfriend went to Dubai. And here are some photos. So in Dubai, I decided that if I would find the bag there in Louis Vuitton, then I would get it. So me and my boyfriend went to the store in the Dubai mall and they told me it was sold out. But then the sales assistant told me that they sometimes get it and she gave me her business cards and told me that she would let me know if they got it the day after. So I waited, I kept my hopes up and then the next day she told me they didn't receive it. But then the day after she texted me and she told me they got it but I, that I had to hurry if I wanted to have it because it, otherwise it's going to be sold out. So we took the first taxi we could get and went to the Dubai mall and I got it. So I'm super happy. I'm not sure what the situation is in Europe at the moment, but at least when I've been trying to get it, it's been sold out everywhere. So I feel really lucky to finally have gotten it. The price of the bag is, uh, it's obviously a luxury bag and it costs about 17,600 Swedish crowns, which is this much in euros and dollars. <laughs> And yeah, let's do the unboxing. This is the bag that I, it came in. And then I also got the box. Very nice. With the metal, no, metal. With the magnetic opening. And here, of course, it has its own dust bag. And here is my baby, the Louis Vuitton Pochette Métisse. So inside you have the strap, which is a very thick piece of canvas. So the material of this bag is canvas and it is very durable. It is not leather. It is a very good material in my opinion. I have it on my Neverfull as well which I have here to show you. So this I've had for years and it's held up really well. And as you can see, the leather, when it matures, it gets very much darker. It used to look like this. So, but at least I know it's a very durable material. Uh, so the strap, you just attach like this. really easy just like that so now i'm going to show you all the compartments of this bag all the features so first you have the louis vuitton paris stamp on this handle which is very nice i really love that you can hold it like this you have a back pocket which opens with this one for keeping your phone or whatever. And then you open it with this clasp. I actually still have the, I don't know if you can see it, I'm gonna take it off. But I still have the plastic on cause I don't want this to scratch immediately. So you open it like that very easily. And then inside you have three compartments, three pockets. One really big one, one a little bit smaller, and then this one in the back. So when I've used it so far, I've mainly used these two because, well, a lot of things can fit in here. I will show you a bit later. So as I already told you, this material is canvas. The inside is microfiber, which is also a very durable material. Kind of feels like a mocha. Not sure what the English word is for that, um, but it's also very good. And you also have this bag in the reverse canvas and the empreinte leather 
I think it's called. But I chose this one because, first of all, I really love the monogram. I think it's beautiful. It's very classic. And the canvas is a bit lighter than, uh, than leather, which is good because this bag that you can put a lot of stuff in. So then you want it to be, you want the bag itself to be light. Also, I chose it because, well, I've seen how well it holds up on this one. So I really like this bag because it's the perfect everyday bag. It's very classic, it is of good quality. The strap is quite wide, so it doesn't hurt your shoulders. Also, you can wear it either crossbody, which I will show you here, or by the handle, like this, which is actually my preference, I would say. So to some of the cons with this bag, the gold hardware is something that because I haven't had this bag for a long time, I haven't seen it yet, but I have seen it on this bag that the gold hardware uh, wears out. So it, it turns into silver and I know you can, uh, you can give it uh, to a Louis Vuitton store and they will make it look good again for fee, but that's just something that's good to be aware about, aware of. And also, I know that this scratches quite a lot because when you have a posing like this, you know, it's very easily, easily scratched. So that's also something to be aware of. So one more con is that I have heard, haven't experienced it yet, that the big pocket, this one in the middle, kind of slouches a bit after a while but it's not a lot. In my opinion, it's not like too much. It just like flattens out a little bit and it makes like this part go out a little bit, like show a little bit more, but that's it. So just to show you how much fits in this bag, I've filled it with some of my, well, sort of everyday things, a perfume. And just be clear, this is not a completely full bag. Um, Chanel powder, AirPods, your lipstick, lip gloss, a card holder, another card holder, some random big wallet, and an iPhone 10. So as you can see, it's really, really roomy. So if you guys want to see pictures of how I style this bag, for example, then follow me on Instagram. And also don't forget to subscribe, to like the video if you liked it. It would make me very, very happy. So just let me know if there's anything else you want to see and have a good one.